I think we have to watch the attitudes in Singapore. I would say generally, attitudes are still quite open. Online, of course, you have very extreme views which are not helpful at all. Uh, in practice, we have been open, in fact, more open than the United States. The United, and, uh, and for a small city-state, that is a very difficult stance to sustain. The United States is open, but you know that immigration is a very charged political issue, and illegal immigrants particularly. Is, uh, there is no solution because you cannot come to a consensus between the uh, parties in Congress. In Singapore, we have to manage it so that it doesn't reach that position. And it's not just a matter of whether people will like it or don't like it. It's what is it which can help to strengthen our society and not dilute us so that suddenly you find that Singapore has changed. We have to adapt, we have to, to evolve, we have to absorb uh, ideas, experiences, um, talent from many parts of the world. But at the same time, there's a some essence and spirit of Singapore which is valuable and you don't want to wake up tomorrow and find that that's gone. And that's where we are. As long as our own population is stable, I think we can manage that. The difficulty comes when your own population is declining, like it is in Germany or in Japan. Then, numerically, you can top up with foreign numbers. But in terms of the essence of it, you become more and more strange as you go along. So make more babies is the slogan. Well, that's a bit of an oversimplification. <laughs> Have more happy families. <laughs>